I'm Ron McDermott, and this is my wife, Maria. We live in Latra, Pennsylvania. We now have four children and four grandchildren and eight therapy cats. Got four or five following me. Definitely part of the family, you know. His mind, he's amazing. That playhouse, no plans, he just built it. He's handy like that. I think that that fix-it attitude has led him to immunotherapy. I was still working full-time, demolition, ground contaminations. He worked up 60 hours a week. 12 days on, two days off. Right. All of a sudden, I just felt this pain. He thought he was just overworked. After months and months of pain, went to the doctor and got it checked. At first, he kept trying to say, you got a pulled muscle. I said, no, nah, I know what a pulled muscle felt like. I was scared. I didn't know what to do. I couldn't work. I was so sore, and I couldn't get around. And I was diagnosed with cancer, spring of 2015. And I had heard of colorectal cancer, but it was really scary. So we just kind of went on automatic and did what the doctor said. And did chemotherapy. He was in chemotherapy for nine months. Dr. Kim said, hey, we're gonna stop the chemo because it wasn't doing any good. And he was so sick. I mean, I don't think he would have lasted another six months. Just but lost all strength. Couldn't eat anything. See him so sick was hard for all of us. When Dr. Kim sent him down to meet Dr. Lee, he knew that he was doing this clinical trial and found he has Lynch syndrome. It was a genetic marker that qualified him to start the immunotherapy. We were pretty excited that there was something we could do. We drive down to Pittsburgh every other week. It takes us an hour. He's on nivolumab and Ipi. The immunotherapy flips the switch and tells the immune system to fight the cancer. It was an immediate difference. It wasn't making him sick. He started to feel better. Two months into it, I knew it, it was working. They gave him two years on the clinical trial. Well, that two years was up in March, but because it is now on the market, he can continue with the immunotherapy. It was so exciting to hear that it got approved by the FDA. Good, now somebody else can benefit. And that was part of the excitement of doing a clinical trial, was knowing that what you were going through could help somebody else. I wouldn't want nobody to go through that. Yeah, right? The only side effect with immunotherapy has been it's now got hypothyroidism. Other than that, I'm really starting to feel better. I'm getting around. It's, it's working great. He's still stage four, but he's not sick. Two years ago, it looked like we were coming close to the end. I'm totally optimistic. Now you're going to get old. Now we won't just look old, we'll be old. <laughs> <laughs> We're planning our summer vacation. Try to take the kids somewhere snorkeling this year and be in the water and swim with the fish, you know. We are so grateful for all the work that the Cancer Research Institute is doing. Without awareness, without research, we're stuck with what we've got. And if we're stuck with what we've got, he'd be gone. Made a big difference in her <laughs> life, that's for sure. It's definitely changed my life. It's making it better.